Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I am Mohammed Yusuf. A telephone call was held between His Royal Highness the Crown Prince and Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa and the Prime Minister of Japan, Fumio Kishida. His Royal Highness and Kishida reviewed ways to further enhance bilateral cooperation. His Royal Highness expressed thanks for Japan Aerospace Exploration Agency's collaboration with Bahrain to launch the Bahrain UAE satellite Light One in February 2022. His Royal Highness and Kishida also reviewed regional and international issues of common interest, including the situation in Ukraine. They emphasized the importance of diplomatic solutions to find peaceful resolutions to conflict. The Japanese Prime Minister then extended congratulations to His Royal Highness on the occasion of the holy month of Ramadan and wished the people of Bahrain further progress and prosperity. The Speaker of the Representatives' Council for Ziya Zainal chaired the weekly meeting where the Council approved a draft law regarding amending some laws on the Consumer Protection Law. The Council also approved a draft law on medals and another draft law to add a new topic to the Civil Service Law. The Kingdom of Bahrain joins the world in celebrating the International Day of Conscience, which coincides on the 5th of April of every year. This Bahraini initiative embodies what the Kingdom aims to achieve under the leadership of His Majesty the King and the follow-up of His Royal Highness the Crown Prince and Prime Minister to actively contribute to everything that promotes world peace and supports the efforts of international community to establish security in the region and the world. The adoption of this International Day of Conscience by the United Nations General Assembly came in response to the initiative of the late Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa with aims to motivating the international community to spread the values of peace, love and cooperation that contribute to achieving a secure and stable world. The Speaker of the Representatives Council for Ziya Zena stressed the urgent need to spread the culture of conscience and peace worldwide, promote the spirit of solidarity and tolerance, and make such lofty values the basis for convergence among various cultures. She affirmed that thanks to His Majesty the King's wise visions, the Kingdom has adopted an advanced approach and became a role model for coexistence, peace and security. In a statement marking the International Day of Conscience, the Speaker asserted that the initiative aims to mobilize the efforts of the international community to achieve the noble goals of the concept of human conscience. She stressed the importance of international collective action in order to lay solid foundations for a permanent peace that creates suitable conditions for countries and peoples to carry out their development process. She underlined the keenness of the Kingdom and its legislative branch to harness all potentials to boost the international efforts aimed to achieving global security and stability. The Chairman of the Shura Council, Ali Saleh, stressed the urgent need to spread the culture of conscience and peace worldwide, promote the spirit of solidarity and tolerance, and make such lofty values the basis for convergence among various cultures. He affirmed that thanks to His Majesty the King's wise visions, the Kingdom has adopted an advanced approach and became a role model for coexistence, peace, and security. In a statement marking the International Day of Conscience, the Chairman asserted that the initiative aims to mobilize the efforts of the international community to achieve the noble goals of the concept of human conscience. He stressed the importance of international collective action in order to lay solid foundations for a permanent peace that creates suitable conditions for countries and peoples to carry on their development process. He underlined the keenness of the Kingdom and its legislative branch to harness all potentials to boost the international efforts aimed at achieving global security and stability. The Minister of Foreign Affairs, Dr. Abdul Latif bin Rashid Al Zayani, commended the humanitarian approach of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa in spreading the culture of tolerance, peace, and coexistence, deepening dialogue and mutual understanding among all religions, cultures, and civilizations, and consolidating international solidarity and global partnership. The Minister expressed pride in the celebration of the World of International Day of Conscience, which was adopted by the UNGA based on the initiative presented by the late His Royal Highness Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa in recognition of the importance of global conscience and concerted efforts of the international community to establish peace and tolerance. The minister underlined the kingdom's keenness to support the efforts of the international community to establish security and reach a just and comprehensive peace in the region and the world. He also noted that the world celebration of the Day of Conscience comes in line with many Bahraini initiatives since the launch of the comprehensive development process of His Majesty the King. The minister stressed that the current international challenges and risks stress the need for a human conscience in stopping wars and conflicts and their causes, freeing the region and the world from weapons of mass destruction, directing resources and wealth for sustainable development, and addressing the problems of poverty, hunger, and epidemics, especially in the least developed countries. 
In conclusion, the minister thanked all employees of the ministry and its diplomatic missions abroad for their relentless patriotic efforts in highlighting Bahrain as a model of tolerance and support for regional and global peace and for their active participation within Team Bahrain under the leadership of His Royal Highness the Crown Prince and Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa and their achievements that deserved high-level national honor by awarding them the Prince Salman bin Hamad Medal for Medical Merit and earned them an appreciation of international organizations and the respect of the world as a humanitarian and civilized example in combating the coronavirus pandemic.